What's new with Prince Andrew? So there's been not great relations between our king, Charles, and his brother, Prince Andrew. And there's been all this kind of dis you know, discussion about whether or not he can stay in the Royal Lodge, whether he can stay in his 30 room, um, huge, huge room with Sarah Ferguson, who also lives there, his ex-wife. Anyway, it seems that they have repaired, um, repaired uh, relations somewhat, and they've agreed that actually, if uh, Prince Andrew pays for the repairs, if he pays for the roof, he's spent a couple of hundred thousand on the roof over the summer, um, and if he pays the, uh, I think there's two million needed to be paid, then he can stay on, he can have a stay of execution, all the royal gags, mm. repair to the throne, all of this. They can stay on there, they won't be shunted out, um, replaced by Prince William and Kate, um, if, he, if he coughs up. He coughs up with what money, though? Because remind money me what job he has again. Yes, no, exactly. Exactly. He's, a, he's a man on benefits, you Listen, go. You should get him to come on and do this. There is, no, absolutely, <laughs> there is absolutely no defence from me for Prince Andrew, but you know the old man worked for the Queen Mother for 40 years. I'll tell you exactly what this is about, right? And I have said this from day one, right? He's a, he's a joke and a disgrace. Yeah. And, and, but what will happen is, because I lived on long while, I've just moved. So um, William and Kate will move into Windsor Castle, absolutely nerd on. The kids are now at a local school uh, in, uh, in Windsor. Um, the thing about this guy, and I'd love your take on this. I've done this with loads of royal commentators. Charles doesn't like confrontation. Yeah. We know that. I'm utterly convinced that they've all got dirt on each other. <laughs> I am so convinced. I'm not saying in any way... Con I think Prince Andrew's a disgrace, genuinely yeah. a disgrace, but... I think somewhere in the deep, dark recesses of Windsor Castle, he's gone to the king and gone, fine, you throw me out and I'll release some stuff on you as well, Pat. I think they're as bad as each other. I'm a, I'm a royalist, but I'm telling you, he was never going to move out of Royal Lodge. Not in a million years was he moving out. Never. Well, also, where's he going? I mean, he's not going to rent a flat down the road from me in Crouch End, is well, he? he? You know, he, they're, they're going to keep him in a palace. They're going to keep him in a palace. And the money's from his mother, by the way, inherited 30 million quid from the Queen. Yeah, but he, he still gets 250,000 a year. He gets a handout of a quarter of a million pounds a year. From, from her. her. From her. Yeah. 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 For what? For what? For well, this king. is his royal handout. He gets. I don't think he does anymore. I think it was stopped. I'd love some fact on that from the team, please. I thought his civil list payment was stopped. Oh, it's stopped been cut. It has when been cut. When he lost his HRH status, I don't think Prince Andrew gets a penny. But he still gets the security pay for. They don't want him doing a book in a Netflix series. This is how you keep it quiet. <laughs> no, that wouldn't be great, yeah, would it? That wouldn't well, be great. too. I think yeah. it's about keeping him quiet. I don't think he has yeah, exactly. dirt. I think it's about keeping him quiet. Prince Charles, uh, King Charles does not want a scandal. You throw what your brother out. Brothers in the royal family, eh? It used to be they have a duel, and now they get it's Netflix families. series. All and... families are like this, but most of us are not on the headline. You know, not the on the first. Yeah. It's true. The it's fascinating true. thing is Fergie, who does still live with him. One wonders, are they are they husband and wife again? She's very supportive. Um, it's an interesting story. But 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 King Charles, you're right, doesn't want scandal. He doesn't. But all of them, but Kate and William, have had scandal. Charles was married. There was, there was, you know, all, all, yeah, all the story with Diana and everything that went on. And, and uh, what I mean by this is a true royalist is I think they're all as bad as each other some of the time. <laughs> I think that we should have moved to William and Kate. I genuinely have said that. I think that that is the future of the British monarchy. Uh, something controversial. As long as we don't do they anything really about are Harry. Spotless, those two. I think that they should have skipped a few generations and gone straight to Louis. I think <laughs> King Louis is what this country needs.